I am going to review the new Seagate 1 terabyte 7200 RPM 32 megabyte cache SATA 6.0 gigabyte 3.5 internal hard drive. Boy, that's a lot to say. Two hundred thousand images, two hundred and fifty thousand songs, a hundred and twenty thousand HD movies, sixty two thousand Blu ray movies. Now, at one point I had twenty eight thousand uh, MP3s that I played on the radio station. I have quite a few more than that now, but the point is, is that I had a two terabyte drive and it barely did anything to it. And that's with everything else. So when I thought I needed a new hard drive, I decided that I didn't need so much room. So I just got one terabyte because my main drive is an SSD and it only holds 500. So how much do I need for a backup? Wow. After 10 years of having a Seagate Barracuda, actually two of them, both drives failed within a matter of days of each other. How long does a hard drive last when the computer is on 24-7 and ready to go at a moment's notice? I should have replaced those two drives three years ago but failed to do so. Then again, 10 years is a long time. I was 17 when I got them. So for Christmas this year, I put the drives on my list. And it was the new Seagate 1TB 7200 RPM. 32 megabyte cache, SATA 6.0 gigabyte, 3.5 inch internal hard drive. Satisfied with my first purchase of Seagate, I was thrilled to have a backup drive again. However, at its speed and cache, it could easily be used as a gaming rig. I happen to use an SSD drive for that. It does not come with screws, but if you are on a newer system like I have, then you will not need them. I took the sides off my Corsair case, installed the drive in the pull-out carrier, and plugged it in. I put the sides back on the case. Total time was five minutes. Then I hit the power button. Instant success. And after a whopping 30 seconds of formatting, I backed up my SSD drive once again. Am I happy with it? You bet. Only Seagate has built so much ease with a hard drive. Believe me, I have had many other drives and they are not up to par. They now have newer Seagate drives out there for around the same price. And they also have newer drives that up to 10 gigabyte if you need it or you're going to run a server. You cannot go wrong with Seagate and thank you Paul for such a nice Christmas present.